Premier Comrade Mielenkov, Comrade Agents, thank you for coming. Here's what we know so far. Ten years ago, the United States government covered up an invasion by an alien race known as Furons. The primary agent was this Furon, Cryptosporidium 137. Dangerous, unpredictable, and now deceased. So, what has been problem? The problem, Conrad, is that Furons can clone themselves and pose convincingly as human. And they've used these abilities to put Cryptosporidium 138 into the White House. And the American people are not noticing? Uh. <laughs> ah, right. Pull the other one. Even worse, this new crypto clone contains pure Furon DNA, harvested from human brains by Orthopox 13, mastermind of the invasion. He also bears a mysterious new mutation, referred to only as the package. Ooh. These aliens pose a dire threat to the Soviet Union, comrades. And so, must be destroyed. As we speak, President Crypto is in Bay City, attending a new cultural festival. And Orthopox? Conducting experiments in the Furon Mothership. Savages. Degenerates. There's only one way to deal with such men. Revolution. Can't be good. <laughs> Greetings, comrade. Mother Russia sends her regards. You expect me to beg, human? No, little Furon. I expect you to die. Mine's big. Virtual pox, huh? Kinda constricting, ain't it? Well, beggars can't be choosers. I need to bring in some big guns. Uh, know where I can get my hands on some? I did manage to jettison some data cores before the mothership was hit. You might be able to recover some weapons from them. 
if you can find any. But it certainly won't be easy. Okay, so, where are the data cores? That's just it! They could have entered the atmosphere at any time, in any place, and therefore landed anywhere on the planet. I've managed to locate only one. It was ejected after my holopox unit, so it landed quite nearby. Well, I guess there's nothing left to do but scout the area and find that data code. Push me, punk. Not the way you... 